when the name Kericho is mentioned, this is what strikes the minds of most people. However, this is the reality on the ground in Kericho County. Dumping sites have become a problem around University of Kabianga and its environs. As a result, both business people and residents have no option other than selecting a place as a dumping site for their waste products, thereby worsening the environmental situation. The dumping site is on an open ground creating an unpleasant look and more so, animals are easily accessing the site consuming the harmful waste. In the Gazette Notice No. 2334 of 28 February 2017, the government of Kenya through NEMA illegalized the use of plastic items as a way of conserving the environment. Unfortunately, this law has not been implemented as there is still the production and use of plastic bags which in turn ends up in dumping sites. Some residents had these views concerning the current situation of the environment. Okay, takataka imekuwa ni shida, imekuwa na shida ya kumali unaweza kupata, unaweza tupa takataka. Sasa okay, unapata labda wakati mwingine tuna tunaweza choma ile takataka. Tunaweza pia okay, una, unaweza chukua tu na tupa tu mali. Okay, una unatafuta tu mali unaweza tupa. Okay, naona kuna kunaweza kuwa na wasiwasi labda kuna ule uchafu kuchafua mazingira. Kuna uchafuzi wa mazingira. Yeah, labda magonjwa vitu kama hizo. Insinerator nadhani nitakuwa nikifaa muhimu kwa kwa hii maeneo ya Kabianga. Sababu so, labda itasaidia pia kumaliza takataka na ile kusaidia pia kupunguza uchafuzi wa mazingira. Na suggest kama wanaweza leta trucks za dustbin wabebe hizi takataka wende wazichome mahali kwa incinerator or something eh, please mbali na hapa wasidampa hapa joto na kwa gonjo kutokana na uchafu kama hii naona we appreciate the initiative of a group of individuals who have taken a step ahead to conserve the environment by collecting plastic bottles for recycling sisi hatujaambiwa sisi ukuja kama hali kama hapa Naona tu angalishie angalishie area hata mazingala iwe safi naona Alafu ambapo ningesema sisi bisiki yetu ni hii Naona vitu kama vile tena naona vitu kama hii machupa machupa kama hii tuenda tunakuta zimetupwa kama hii zinginezo hizi za za bobo kama hizi za faifo Alafu sasa we decided to chip in and help in bringing back the serenity of Kericho County. For the remaining non-biodegradable waste, our group came up with a disposal solution which is the construction of a homemade incinerator, a burning to clean project. Yeah, yeah. 
Functions of the incinerator include the chimney for emitting gas in small quantity, the door, it should be big enough to access rubbish and fire compartments, the wire mesh to place burning materials and prevent them from exiting the drum and potentially causing other fires. Then the air vents. These are for air circulation. The homemade incinerator is meant to burn papers, cardboard, and packages that are not recycled where we live. Some of the importance of the incinerator include to reduce the volume of waste. When it comes to getting rid of your yard wastes and other debris, burning often seems to be the best way to go. Open fires can be very dangerous if wind carries sparks or other burning materials away and can start larger fires. Making and operating an incinerator is a responsible and safe way to burn waste without the high risk of open fires. 4. With few commonly available materials, you can make your own incinerator that will last for years. Those are just but some of the importance. Hiyo kitu inatusaidia kutoa takataka kwa kijiji. 
kwa kijiji. Eh maoni yangu ni vile tungetaka mm -hmm. kila kijiji ipate hiyo kitu alafu tusiie hali ya uchafu katika kijiji. But hiyo basic ile mention ina work. Mm -hmm. Yeah itapunguza hii garbage hapa. Yeah na pia kuiban. Ni poa. Hii garbage ungetoa hiyo namna iban. Niko tu sawa itatoa hii dump site. But any place poa kuna staff inaweza fanyika hivi. Audio jungle. Remember, your surrounding determines your life. It's no longer an option to conserve the environment. Our environment, our responsibility. Audio Jungle